teach the controversy rather than try and censor out the information that shows yes. that evolution you know, is, is questionable. Sir, where, where did you study science? Well, see, that's the point. Uh, scientists are now claiming that they're the only ones that can speak on this issue. It's almost like a religion in which only scientists are allowed to speak and teach on it and to teach everyone else. And everyone else must believe okay. what the scientists, what particular scientists say. Where is the evidence of um, evolution from one species to another species? The macroevolution. <laughs> There's microevolution within a species, but not going from one species to another. Oh, really? if, if we gone from that that broad of an evolution there should be overwhelming tons of material evidence not just an isolated uh, no, uh, isolated thing here that. but again uh, there is not evidence I have almost every fossil you find is intermediate <laughs> with something and something if that else. were the case the Smithsonian National His Natural History Museum would be filled with these examples well, but it, instead it they're is. not it is. I just told you about Australopithecus Homo habilis Homo erectus Homo sapiens, a beautiful, by the way, archaic Homo sapiens and then modern Homo sapiens. That's a beautiful series of You're intermediates. You're still lacking the material evidence. The so material evidence is there. <laughs> Go to the museum and look so at what it. I go Have you seen Homo erectus? <laughs> Have you seen Homo habilis? Have you seen Australopithecus? <laughs> I've, I've asked I've, you that what I've, seen, what I've seen is that in the museums and in the textbooks that whenever they claim that to show the evolution from one species to another, it relies on illustrations and drawings, no, it not, the, um, not any can, material evidence. Can, can you point to any positive scientific evidence in favor of creation? Uh, I think the, the fact, as you pointed out, DNA, I think DNA helps to show that each one of us are individuals. And yes, but they have to be individuals distinct. for evolution to work. I mean... Uh, I, I don't think that's the case. I think well, that the fact sorry, that each one that if evolution had occurred, then surely whether it's going from birds to mammals or or even beyond that, surely there'd be at least one There's evidence. A massive amount of evidence.